Hello, I am Dr. Rajat Atreya, Lead Neonatologist and Senior Consultant Pediatrician at Rainbow Children's Hospital, Sarjapur Road, Bangalore. Today, I am going to talk about fussy eating. Of all the things that I get asked in my day-to-day -day work, my child does not eat tops the list. This is a very common question and problem that parents come to me with. So, rather than your child is not eating well, probably she is not eating what you want her to eat, uh, the way you want her to eat in the frequency and the quantity that you want uh, her to eat. I also get asked, are there medicines to stimulate her appetite? Uh, I have to tell you that there is no safe medic medicine that can be prescribed which will increase the appetite of the child. Instead of that, I am going to prescribe you five things that you can do to get your child to eat much better. The first thing is reduce the milk intake. So a lot of parents give a lot of milk to the child and this kills the appetite. The second thing on my prescription is that restrict the meal time or the efforts to feed the child to about 20 to 30 minutes at a time. If you drag this on for a long time, it becomes a battle and it is always a losing battle for the parent. The third thing is do not make this a project uh, aimed at uh, getting your child to eat. Make this a family event where all of you sit down with your plates full of meals. Let the child play with the food, mess around and start feeding herself. And this will encourage her to start liking food and start eating well. The fourth thing is um, that um, let there not be bribing, distraction, threatening when you have to feed your child. So let uh, talk about the food, talk about where you got the food from, how you made it, how it looks, um, it's a nice color, it tastes well, and those kind of things. And talk about the food when you're feeding the child rather than uh, keeping a mobile phone in front of her or threatening her if she doesn't eat, something is going to happen to her. Or if she eats, she's going to get an ice cream. So do not do that. Let meal times be about just the meals themselves. And the last thing is very, very important and the most important point in my prescription for better eating. That is, if you want your child to feel hungry, you need to allow her to stay hungry. So if she doesn't take breakfast or lunch properly, do not give her an alternative snack like biscuits or milk or anything like that. Till the next four to five hours, let her stay hungry. So this requires a lot of discipline on part of parents and grandparents. And they often don't feel like letting the child just be without eating. But this is the most important thing that you can do. So if the child doesn't eat a meal, allow her to stay hungry till the next meal or the meal after. Probably give her a drink of water if she's getting tired. So uh, let her feel the hunger and she'll start eating. Happy parenting.